Before we proceed, please note that this video is edited by AI but all the content is manually researched by our team and it's not AI generated. Here we will talk about the F1 TV error code BM2101. Firstly, it's important to know that the error code BM2101 is frequently encountered when users attempt to airplay the F1 TV app to their televisions, or simply when opening the app on their devices. The F1 TV app support has acknowledged the issue and are working on a solution. However, in the meantime, there are a number of solutions available. The first fix is to download the app directly onto your television. Many users have reported encountering the error when trying to airplay F1 TV from their phones to their TVs. It's crucial to know that F1 TV doesn't officially support airplay, except when casting to Apple TV. Therefore, to avoid this issue, it's advisable to install the F1 TV app directly onto your TV. If you still wish to cast F1 TV to your television, a second solution is to use an HDMI cable and a laptop. This method allows you to cast F1 TV directly from their website to your television. The third fix involves simply relaunching the F1 TV app. Close the app, wait around 20 seconds, and then reopen it to see if the problem has been resolved. If relaunching the app doesn't work, the fourth solution is to sign out and then sign back into the app. Start by signing out, then close the app and wait around 20 seconds before reopening it and signing back into your account. If neither relaunching the app nor re-signing in resolves the issue, the fifth solution is to restart your device. This can often fix temporary bugs within the device that may be causing the problem. The sixth fix involves clearing the cache and storage for the F1 TV app. After doing so, check to see whether the error has been resolved. Finally, if none of the above solutions work, the seventh and final solution is to contact F1 TV support for further assistance. In summary, the solutions to the F1 TV error code BM2101 range from downloading the app directly onto your TV, using an HDMI cable and laptop, relaunching the app, signing out and back into the app, restarting your device, clearing the app's cache and storage, and finally, contacting F1 TV support. If you like this information, don't forget to subscribe, it will be a great support. And for more tech updates, visit queries.com.